Naam karibu kwenye taarifa kamili na kusihi uandamane nami kuanzia sasa hadi tamati mwa taarifa hizi. Ni tehadi ya mwasiwa. Na mwanasheria mkuu Justin Muturi amekanusha madai kuwa serikali ya Kenya kwanza imekuwa ikikiuka amri ya mahakama. Akizungumza alipohudhuria mazishi kijiji cha Kaungu Mbere kaskazini kaunti ya Embu, Muturi ameshikilia kuwa serikali kupitia afisi yake imekuwa ikifuata amri zote zilizotolewa na mahakama. Aidha amesema wamekuwa wakikatarufa katika maamuzi ambayo upande wao haukukubaliana nayo akiwahimiza viongozi na wakenya kwa jumla kuheshimu katiba. Wakati huo huo aliunga mkono mazungumzo ya maridhiano akihimiza sheria kufuatwa akiwaonya viongozi kutoliweka taifa katika joto la uchaguzi wakati uchaguzi ulishakamilika. We know the talks are happening at Bombers of Kenya. But these talks Whatever the agenda in those talks can be done at the National Assembly under the Senate. Because those talks are geared towards selfish interests of one person called Raila Odinga. Whether it is elections, that is why the Attorney General I have forwarded an amendment of Election Act 2011, Article 24, and Article 44 of the election act so that we are able to automate the election process of the Republic of Kenya. Nimeona watu wengine sisi wengine wakisema serikali ya William Ruto eh at he is not obeying court orders. There is not a single one which has not been obeyed. Even when we disagree, even when we don't like those judgments, but we we obey the court orders. We have been obeying all the orders because we must promote constitutionalism in the country hiyo ndio kuleta amani katika nchi kwa sababu uchaguzi utakuja leo utakuja kesho kutwa eh ukiisha wacheni wananchi waendelee na shughuli zingine zao za kujenga nchi we cannot be perpetually involved in politics Naam, na serikali inapania kutoa chanjo dhidi ya ugonjwa wa kupooza yani polio.